yeah, obviously there's pressure. There feels like a massive responsibility. This is such a beloved story and these are such beloved characters and like very iconic. Um, but this adaptation isn't like, you know, like any other ad adaptation. It's very, you know, it's not similar to the movie at all. So um, I think, yeah, I think it will hopefully feel like a, re a refreshing take and something that people hopefully haven't seen before. Yeah. Whether they're coming to it fresh or they know the story really well. I loved the uh, the first few years. Just like kind of, it was a fairly normal hairdo, but there were like, there was, um, what's the hat? The biscuit pork hat, pie. pork pie hat. There was a pork pie hat that I wore <laughs> for a scene um, where I'm, he's doing the like radio, not radio, the TV, the TV show. show thing. Thank you, Uncle. Um, but it was the only time I got to wear it. I wanted to wear it on all, in all the scenes. But I couldn't. Still um. grooming it a little bit. Uh, uh, mine was the the dress I got to work wear at the beginning of the first episode. I'm sorry, did I get something in your jacket? Oh, sorry. Uh, <laughs> sorry, did I? Sorry that I touched you. Um, no, I the, the dress that I wore in the first episode because um, it was just full on 80s. I think it's probably the, like the most extreme costume that I had in the whole show, and like we paired it with like a leather belt and like the permed hair, and it just felt so era and period specific. Mm. I have like a real soft spot for that dress, yeah. Mm. Yeah, absolutely. Um, well, first of all, like just to have his blessing on everything is huge. Um, I spoke to him, like I like, had a Zoom with him quite early on and um, just like spoke to him about Emma for like an hour and asked him every question about her that I could think of. Um, but he also wrote one of the episodes and was like there for the whole process. So yeah, it was like a real honor to get to work with him so closely. He's a very sweet, humble man. He didn't, yeah. he didn't like, yeah, when we knew he was on set, it was very much like, <gasps> David's here. Yeah. But he, yeah. Was, he is like also the least scary man in the world. He would sort of hide. He'd he kind of hide away. Like yeah. You wouldn't know that he was there because he'd be sort of hiding away behind yeah. the monitor <laughs> and then he'd sneak off into the night. Um, <laughs> yeah. Lovely man. I watched them with someone, maybe. Yeah. Um, and. Box of tissues. tissues yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, don't watch it al alone, maybe. Yeah. Or do if that's your thing. No, but yeah, maybe, um, it's, maybe it's easier. Yeah. Uh, but just feel what you've got. Yeah. Feel what you're going to feel. <laughs>